What progress do you think you've seen from uh, your side of the ball this during the extra time you've had to prep? Um, I think we got better in the run game. You know, we, believe it or not, simplified, which is hard to imagine <laughs> when you have four run plays. Uh, but we, we simplified some stuff and we got better. Is your offensive line with the change you've made feeling good? I think so, yeah. Um, I think that, you know, I think everybody got better. I was really pleased with some of the backups. I think they were encouraged when they saw they had a chance to play. And, and um, so those guys practiced well, which is usually the case. Any uh, clarity on who's going to be your starting right guard? Do you think it'll be crossweight? Probably so, yeah. Yeah, I think it will be. What are your thoughts on how the rain could affect this offense? There's probably about a 50% chance of rain. I always tell the guys that rain, that we love the rain, and we think it's huge. We, we hope it pours. And we hope it has sheets of rain, monsoons of rain. We think <laughs> it helps our offense tremendously. And I think uh, it's rain is whatever you tell, it's whatever you believe it to be. You know, there's been incredible games of massive scoring, throwing the ball every snap with sheets of rain, and then there's been horrible games. Uh, it just depends on your attitude. So our attitude is we love it. Hope it rains a bunch. So your teams have traditionally actually played pretty well in the rain? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we'll play well in the rain. When we're good, we do. Yeah. And when we're bad, we play bad and rain some. <laughs> it doesn't matter, you know. But, yeah, I've seen, a lot, I've seen a lot of big games in rain and snow and sleet and all that stuff. With Jared being a young quarterback, what do you look for as growth steps and his progression through this freshman year? Um, you know, I think the things that he's done in the last couple of weeks, which is not turning it over as much, um, you know, he had a couple um, of nears last week that he got lucky with, you know, and sometimes I tell him, you know, the football gods kind of go back and forth. You know, you have a couple the first week that you don't deserve, and you have a couple that you do deserve that you don't get, and it all evens itself out in the long run. But I think that's the biggest thing is just to play error free football. How's his accuracy been on the deep ball? Good, good. I mean, you know, that kid's as accurate as anybody you'll see throwing deep balls. So, yeah, he's, he's good. Is Oregon's offense kind of a model of what you guys might want to strive to be like? Is that? Uh, not exactly the same thing, but. Yeah. Um, kind of the numbers and the statistics. Yeah, we'd about. rather be like Louisiana Tech last year, you know, <laughs> which was better than Oregon. So, yeah. you know, that's what we'd rather be. But, yeah. We're good? Really good. good. Thanks, right. Thanks so much. Thank you all. Have see you.